frustrates about us in a situation like that, particularly with the first goal, because we can clearly hear Danny called early as the ball comes in. Yeah, listen, it's just a decision you have to you make as a defender in the game. Um, there's no real trouble. The ball's coming in. It's like you say, it's coming into Danny's hands. But it's as a defender, you make those decisions. And since he's been with us in the short time, he's been absolutely brilliant. And he normally makes the the right decisions. It was just freakish, really, the the goal. And um, and then he was unfortunate with the second one also. It's obviously a disappointing for him. He'd been obviously more with the first one, but um, but he's a real strong character and. You know, he's, like I said, he's been very, very good for us since he's come in. He's always been away at the World Cup, not played a minute, so it's going to take him a few games to get his rhythm back. Um, but I've got no doubt about him. I think he showed in the time when he was playing in Rem and then he joined us, the level that he's at and he can get to. Um, tonight, it was just unfortunate for him. Yeah, yeah. I had that once in my career that a player scored two own goals. So I really feel for him, I honestly, because I was absolutely unlucky. The first is a... Yeah, how can it be more unlucky in the second one? If you ever played football, you go full speed in that situation, direction goal. You would expect the ball goes in. That's what your brain tells you in the moment when you realize it's not going. It's going to the post. You can't react anymore. So these things happen. Yes, of course, I feel sympathy. There's absolutely space for that. Um, but whatever I say now will not change it. So, um, but. The boy will get through this, obviously, and um, and Brent will help him with that, so everything will be fine.